Alrighty, from 2020, and it's 1541, not the year. We're past that. We're way fucking past that. Hardcover for Steven Universe, End of an Era. 274 pages of this franchise. So, let's run it off, shall we? So, Steven Universe fans out there, you can check this out on my channel. Because... It's going to stay on my channel forever. I'm not taking it down. So, Table of contents. I have not looked at this, actually. So there are artist credentials. Actually, hold on. There's artist credentials in the back, too. So, ah, let me make sure. Okay, cool. So this is everybody that's involved with this project. Just so you know. Yeah. Oh my. Wow, well, Natasha Leon. Cool. I like her in Orange is the New Black. Alrighty, Sebastian. So now we can bring this stuff off. How about that? So they saw that shit. There you go. So, I'm guessing there's a shit ton of spreads to this. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Wasn't expecting a uh, Oktoberfest dress. The text, pictures, spreads. Okay. Average art book. <laughs> no, I don't mean that for this, but like it's every art book. That's how they all run off. Oh, good. I don't have to go back and forth. Yay. <laughs> And I've already covered Steven Universe, the movie, so you can check that out, the art book for it on my channel as well. Yeah. Wow, that is a lot of fucking detail. <laughs> I don't even do see this kind of shit, though. Like, that's really, really good and super helpful. I don't even do that when I'm writing. I just write away. But I'm left-handed, so. Yeah, I don't write down details. Well, no, I do write down details now. Because I tend to forget shit. <laughs> Perks of memory loss. <laughs> uh, have I ever watched Steven Universe? No. It's not my cup of tea. Like, honestly, it's just really not. But if I watched it, I would probably enjoy it. But, eh, I don't know. I find there's more stuff that's not my kind of era versus my kind of era. Yeah. But this is an interesting book, though. Storyboards, as always, because every art book has storyboards just about. Unless it's an art in making, then there's really no storyboards to it. But this is a good essential art dump. I like that. Good colors. Boy. Hold damn time. I do. Okay. Top secret. Ooh, baby. Man, that is some detailed shit, dude. Crazy. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> I get so sick of these vertical shots, man. They irritate the hell out of me. It's irritating because every time I see, I equate vertical with sunset shots because in sunset shots, it irritates the shit out of me too because people film it vertical and I'm like, no, it's horizontal. Like, I don't get it. Yeah. 
But if you enjoy Cartoon Network, you enjoy Steven Universe, it's part of your childhood, and you're going to have a good time going through this book yourself. If not, though, I totally get it, because not everybody's into Steven Universe. Nobody cares for LGBT cartoons. I miss Sally Mae. What the fuck? <laughs> Even Nora's like, yeah, I miss Sally Mae too. What the blue fuck? What the hell? What the hell? Oh, I thought they were marrying the horse. I'm like, all right. Okay. Nina Tucker will be very proud of that. <laughs> Oh, my. <laughs> if you don't like LGBT content, well, this is not a book for you, then. You bigot. <laughs> the designs are very interesting and definitely fit Cartoon Network's layout. I would also say they fit 90s Nickelodeon layout as well. Yeah. If you grew up watching 90s Nickelodeon, you know exactly what the fuck I'm talking about. But if you didn't, you should definitely check that shit out. <laughs> because literally, that's the building blocks for Steven Universe. And hell, even 90s Cartoon Network in early 2000s as well. Both of them brought this to life <laughs> decades later. It's a wild ass world. White diamond. Where's black diamond? Where's the other colored diamonds? Why is this so racist? very interesting though but I don't need to own it because I don't buy a lot of these books they're all from the library yeah I'm the type where I don't need to spend X amount of money on stuff where I can just check my library to see if they have it in circulation to read cheaper and it's free <laughs> seriously people just spree buy shit are so dumb and I'm guilty of doing the same thing, but at least I take my time with it. Oh, hugs. I do like the designs, but eh. It is what it is. Not me. Very intriguing. I like the colors though. Colors are very bright, very lively. Good atmospheres, good temperatures. Even the lighting is amazing and the shadows. I don't like these spreads where it's text and then like a few shots. Like that's dumb. So stupid. Like if you were just gonna do that, you could have just saved it for like a whole separate page. <laughs> or just made it a complete art dump. Art dumps are always the best. Those make me the happiest. <laughs> She's cute. <sighs> well, that's a cool car. I like that.
And of course, all the sort you can trace back not only to 90s Nickelodeon and Cartoon Network, but also lots of 80s stuff as well. So many homages. I can't even name them all off, but yeah. And that's it. That's the entire book. So, I'll be back with another one. Stay tuned.